Hi, my name is Petter and I'm a product engineer here at Blue Eye Robotics. I have been a part of the engineering team that has worked closely with integrating these three sonar options to our Blue Eye X3 drone. All of the sonar integrations have been made with careful consideration to how it will affect the hydrodynamic properties of the drone. The final product reflects this in a sleek integration between peripheral and drone. All of these sonar options comes with software from the manufacturer, which makes it very easy to get an overview over the situation when you're out diving with the drone. First up, we have the ISS360 from Impact Subsea. The ISS360 has a small but solid metal build. Uh, this option is definitely for the professional who requires the highest quality uh, sonar imaging from their peripheral. The ISS360 has a scanning radius of up to 90 meters, so you can get a very uh, wide overview over the diving area where you are diving with the X3. This sonar is connected mechanically to the frame of the drone itself, which means you can take off the covers of the drone without having to remove the sonar itself. We have added extra buoyancy to the drone. And this is so the weight of the sonar won't affect uh, the diving properties of the drone when you're out diving. Let's have a look at our second option. Here we have the Ping360 from Blue Robotics. This is a similar integration as the ISS360. With the Ping360 you have two different mounting options based on your needs. Either you can have a more seamless uh, integration of the sonar here in the back of the drone. Uh, or if you have multiple peripherals and you're gonna change them out over time, then it's also possible to have uh, the Ping360 mounted on the universal mount in the front of the drone. Both of the options has different pros and cons, and it's up to your use case to decide which one is best for you. Similar to the ISS360, this sonar can also be used for navigational purposes. Compared to our two other sonar options, the Ping360 is a more budget-friendly alternative. Now let's take a look at our final option. This is the Micron Gemini from Tritec. This is the best sonar for navigating. And uh, with the mounting we have done here in the universal mount for the X3 drone, you can either have it pointing directly forward or you can angle it slightly downwards to get a better view of the seabed. The Micron Gemini has a very impressive quality compared to its small build. It's easy to get detailed sonar imaging of your underwater surroundings. With the multi-beam, you get a 90 degree field of view and up to 50 meter range. This is a small light option for the professionals who require high responsive imaging of their underwater surroundings. All of these sonars have different areas that they excel in, so it's important to find out which one works best for your job to be done. You can find all the technical specifications for all of these sonars on our webpage. And if you have any questions, ask them in the chat or reach out to our team, who will happily answer any questions and help you find which sonar is right for your job to be done. Thank you for watching.